What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Pick Plug back again with another video, and today we'll be hopping into Thursday's picks for today. Now, we have been on an amazing hot streak as of recently in the Discord, so if you guys do want to join and get part of the amazing picks that we do have in the Discord, make sure to click that link in the description below and get the full six pick parlay. As of recently, you guys can see the winnings here in the Discord from the past week, and like I said, we have been winning like crazy and we've been hitting those special plays. Um, that we have been dropping the discord from all sports books um prize picks underdog um this has been amazing and we have been uh just changing a lot of people um and having a lot of uh winners as of recently so if you guys uh can see we have a bunch of uh winnings a bunch of different types of winnings even from 15 right into like 300 so definitely a lot um and as of recently it's definitely um great to see now uh, if you guys do want a part of that, again, you guys can join the Discord down in the description below. Like I did say in my past video, Platinum will be ending up closing soon. Um, and by closing, I do mean that we won't be allowing any more members to join it. Um, I did get a couple emails saying that, oh, Platinum, uh, is it closing for the people that already have Platinum? No, the people that already have Platinum will still be able to have it. It is just for the people that are going to be joining uh, later on so this friday um after that that is the last day so saturday and going forward until further notice platinum will not be joinable um for the next couple of days or um until further notice so if you guys want to go ahead and join um make sure to go ahead and join uh because there will be a bunch of upgrades and features coming to it and as soon as we get more staff on hand we will be reopening it but without further ado let's hop into today's picks for our first pick of the day, we will be going to the rebounds plus assist tab and we'll be scrolling down to Jalen Brunson, 10.5 rebounds plus assist. And this one is going to be for more. Looking at his last five games, we can see that he's gotten the over four out of the last five games and he is averaging 11.4 in the last five. Now his line is 10.5 and I do think this might be a prop that ends up getting bumped up later in the day. So again, if you guys do want these picks, um, before they do get bumped in a lot of the high value picks make sure to subscribe and turn your post notification button so that you guys can get a notification when i post in his last game against detroit he did end up having 13 rebounds plus assists in the game before that against boston which is an amazing defense they did end up having 12 rebounds plus assists now his matchup against warriors is definitely looking uh very good today considering that um he has hit this line in seven out of the last 10 games um, and the games that he didn't hit them, um, these were um, pretty, uh, this one was a blowout against Orlando. Um, so he obviously wasn't playing as, uh, as many uh, minutes. And uh, this one was a close game, but uh, it was against Indiana. I'm not too sure what happened there, but looking here at Warriors, uh, this is definitely a solid matchup for him, considering that they do allow 22nd in most in the league assists uh, allowed and they are 15th in rebounds rebounds allowed overall they are 12 and 12 and um from the shooting guard position they are five and one so they're kind of all over the place when it comes to uh, guarding the rebounds and assists but for the point guard position they allow the rebounds uh they allow these assists uh one of the most in their defense so that is definitely a crack in their defense they allow so many assists from the point guard position now as of lately Jalen Brown uh, Jalen Brunson uh, his minutes rate has been actually pretty high um, and he is averaging around 37.9 minutes um, and he definitely has a very very high risk usage rate so he is used to playing those high um, minute games even as against teams that are kind of blowouts um, he tends to play very um, high minutes and he still gets the stats that he normally does um, so that's why he's pretty consistent with going on the over for most of these props something that you guys might be, want to be uh looking into is that andrew wiggins is out um og ananobi is out um and julius randall is out so this is why he has to be a little bit more aggressive um, when it comes to scoring and uh, assisting and rebounding because julius rebound uh, julius randall is uh definitely have to uh cover for him when he is out um and you're missing a big part of that um so yeah we're going to be going on the over for rebounds plus assists on the over for 
for our next pick for today we'll be going to the points tab and we'll be going for franz wagner 21.5 points and this one is going to be for more now if you look at his last five games you might be thinking that this may be a risky prop to go on the over four he has been averaging 17.8 in the last five and his line is 21.5 he's missed this prop in the last five games straight and he has not hit this in a pretty long time um, looking here on outlier which you guys can actually get for yourself clicking that link in the description below you guys can get a free seven day trial um, just to try out this optimizer tool you guys can see that in the last six games he has missed this line um, so it's definitely uh, not looking too good for him but his matchup is saying otherwise against Utah they are 25th in points allowed in the league and against the small four position there are 20 seconds in points allowed um, another thing I do want to mention is that injuries uh, Paulo Bancaro is actually listing as game time decision so if he is out due to illness this is definitely looking more of a higher scoring game for Franz Wagner since he will have to take on more of a scoring role for tonight's game looking here on matchups we can still see um, or looking at, at the usage rate we can see that uh, he averages around 33 minutes so his usage rate hasn't changed even though he has not hit this line as of recently he's still averaging around 30, 30 minutes um in his last game he did end up uh, end up having 28 minutes um in a 20 plus point game and it was uh he did end up ha having 21 points now another thing i do want to mention is that head to head he's hit this line two out of three times in his last game he was very close having 21 points um, in a two point game. So these are uh, mostly um, closer games. Not, uh, they, these are all games that are within like five points. They're not blowouts or five or six points. They are, are not blowouts. So these are definitely um, a good thing to see. Now, if you guys wanna go on the over for this points, I do think it's a, a good time to go for the over. And I do think he's gonna break his shooting streak uh, tonight. Another reason why I'm liking this prop so much is that on chalkboard, you guys can actually alternate this prop to 19.5 instead of 21.5 if you think that is too high for him to go and hit. Again, chalkboard is an app that you guys can sports bet on and change the line as you wish and get a higher payout according to how you change it. So if you guys change it to 19.5, uh, you guys can uh, have the higher um, guaranteed hit. And this is definitely a prop that I'll go for for myself. So if you guys want to go ahead and change that to 19.5 or try out chalkboard for yourself, make sure to use code TROPHY for 100% deposit match on your first deposit, as well as getting a free month of VIP down in the Discord server below. So make sure to just DM me proof um, that you use my code and I'll get you guys that free uh, VIP Discord server. <laughs> All right, so for our last prop for today, we'll be going over to the rebound section and we'll be going over to Jalen, John Collins, nine, 8.5 rebounds. And this one is going to be for more. Looking here in the last five games, we can see that he's gone on the over four out of the last five games and he's averaging 11.8 when he needs 8.5 rebounds. So that is a pretty good ratio to see. In his last game, he did end up having 10 rebounds the game before he had eight and the game before he had 18 rebounds against the Charlotte Hornets. So he is definitely um, a, a, on a good um, hot streak right now of going, uh, having higher rebounds. And his, this is definitely a prop for him to go on the over four tonight going up against Orlando. Now looking here on outlier, we can see that he's hit this line eight out of the last 10 games. And this is definitely a solid matchup for him considering that the, he has hit this in the last game against Orlando. Um, and this was a tight game, um, having a scoring, uh, it was a two point uh, deficit. Now in this game, um, what did he have? In this game, he actually ended up having 15 points as well. So he is definitely um, a good scorer plus rebounder against this team. So if you guys wanna combine the both and go on the over four rebounds plus points, that would be a good prop as well. But for right now, we'll be going for the rebound stat alone and we'll be going on the over. Um, but looking here uh, on his usage rate in the last 10 games, uh, we can see that this has definitely been varying um, going from 22 points to the highest of 33 points. And in the last 20 games, um, it's varied from 34 to the lowest of uh, 14 minutes um, in the last uh, 20 games. So we can see that his usage rate has been scaling uh, very differently but in the most recent 
in the last uh, 10 games, his usage rate has been um, is a lot higher than normal because of his ability to go on the over for most of these props. So this is definitely a solid prop to go for. Also, if you guys do see that Hall of Bancaro is a game time decision, if he is out, this will definitely affect um, the rebounding of this game. And if he is out, he should definitely be going on the over for the rebounds considering that they lose a big amount of rebounding uh, without Paulo Vancaro. But if you guys do like any of these picks, let me know down in the comment section below. I do appreciate all your insight. Um, we are keeping on this streak of posting um, every day of the year. We keep posting these e these early um, prop videos for you guys to get these picks out, these high valuable picks before they get bumped. So if you guys want us to keep on do doing that, make sure that you guys hit that subscribe button like the video let's get this video to 250 likes for a bonus prop in tomorrow's video and uh, make sure you subscribe and turn on those post notifications that you guys get a notification whenever i post and you guys don't miss out on these high value picks but uh, that is all for this video thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace